what's up guys in this tutorial we'll cover the math.h uh, library or the math.h is a header file so if we are using this library we must just include it uh, in our source code okay math.h library has uh, a number of function uh, the main thing about the functions are that they always take double as a argument and always return a double as in the data uh, something like this it would have double as a return type a function name whatever function name and it always uh, takes double as uh, its argument maybe one or two and one or double y so it's not compulsory that there are two parameters passed or there could be one or two okay depending on the function okay we'll start with it with trigonometric functions the first one uh, is sine okay again it takes uh, double as a pa there is only one ar argument so double x so what this function would uh, do is return sine of x uh, here x is in radians ok I'll write that also x in radians so if you have sine of uh, pi by 4 as in pi by 4 means 3.14 divided by 4 so you will get it as uh, 1 upon root 2 okay so you will get it as double as in 1 divided by 1.414 the exact value I don't know but yeah similarly there are functions like cos tan they work in the same way the next category of functions are a hyperbolic function that is uh, sin h again it works the same way it takes double as a parameter double x returns hyperbolic sine of x again it returns uh, double similarly you have functions like cos h and tan h ok the next type of functions are the cos inverse function the as an inverse function cos inverse sine inverse and tan inverse for example I'll take it as uh, okay they are written as a sine and again it takes double okay I'll just write here these all functions written double so it's better if I write define it this way double sine again double all these functions are returning double again we have for sine inverse we have a sine so I'll write double so it ret uh, what the it returns sine inverse of x similarly our functions for a uh, cos inverse as a cos and tan inverse as a tan so example of uh, sine inverse would be if we write a sine of uh, suppose half ok a sine of 0.5 so we know that it is pi by 6 so it would return 3.14 divided by 6 that double value whatever it is oh. ok the next type of function we have uh, log logarithmic functions we have two logarithmic functions the first one is log again it returns a double it takes as a parameter double ok I'll write here it returns log of x actually the function names are quite explanatory so ok this log is to the base e 
Uh, similarly, you have something like this. log 10 suppose I want something to the base 10 log to the base 10 so you have this function log to the log base 10 and it takes double as a par argument and returns a double okay suppose now I need if I want to find phi square or support not phi square phi square is quite simple as in phi raised to the power phi so uh, phi into phi into phi into phi into phi five times so we have a power function it takes two well it again returns a double first I'll write that it would take uh, two arguments as parameter a double x and double y and what it returns x raised to y as in if you write f uh, double of uh, as in you'll if you write power of phi comma phi or phi comma 2 so you will get phi square that's 25 okay similarly if I need to find a square root of a number so I have a function like double sqrt again I'll double x return square root okay if I write square sqrt of 25 it would return me a phi okay it returns a positive square root Uh, similarly, yeah, uh, I have a function to find the modulus of a number. Modulus, uh, I mean, a positive value of a number, absolute value of a number, f abs. And again, it takes double. Uh, uh, double x. returns absolute value as in the positive value so if I write f apps of minus 10 it would return me 10 but if I write f apps of 10 it would return me 10 so if you have a negative number and you pass it as an argument it would return the positive part okay there are two other func uh, functions floor and seal okay how does that work uh, suppose I have a double no double as in 4.313 okay suppose I write floor of uh, 4.313 so it would return me an integer which is smaller than this but of greatest value so the integer which is uh, smaller than 4.313 is uh, many integers yeah from minus infinity to uh, 4 there are many integers it will return me a integer which is smaller than uh, 4.313 but uh, but greatest amongst the all as in the closest to 4.313 but smaller than it so it would be equal to 4 and similarly if I find right seal of uh, 4.313 so it would return me an integer which is greater than 4.313 but closest to 4.313 as in it would return me 5 5 so both these function actually return uh, though uh, we are writing at 4 or 5 it returns a double as in 4.0 and 5.0 so they are like uh, the functions are actually double floor and takes as a parameter double x and I have seal okay I'll just write here returns largest in integer smaller than x I'll just copy this out 
for this it would have returned me the smallest in integer larger than x or greater than x better okay so let's try this floor and seal in our program as many get confused between the two okay i'll open a new file i'll write first my basic structure as include stdio dot h int main and return zero okay in the first printf statement I'll write uh, so that I take uh, uh, I'll write floor of four point okay I'll take a new number suppose eight point nine eight point nine one is then I'll write percentage LF since it it's returning a double so LF and I will call the function floor of 8.91 okay yeah and we need to include that uh, header file mat.h let's quickly save our file I'll give it a name math library math lib oh let's execute a file and see compile and run okay floor of 8.91 is 8.0000 yes that's what you were expecting and let's quickly find the seal of 8.91 Okay, I'll put a backslash in after the first print statement for a new line. Okay, now so let's execute a file and see. Okay, it's giving floor of 8.91 is 8 and seal of 8.9 was is 9. Uh, so if you still are getting confused between floor and seal, uh, one way to remember is that uh, floor, floor means the bottom part and seal, seal or the ceiling means the upper part. So bottom of 8.91 you can say it as 8 and seal or the upper of 8.91 is 9 uh, this is the way I remembered but you can do it anywhere uh, I think I covered almost all um, math.h library functions uh, maybe I missed one or two you can uh, find it on the internet okay yeah that's it for this tutorial see you in the next one please do subscribe to our channel like our video and do provide your suggestions for our improvement thank you